when you read in the Old Testament and the New Testament, you are going to see that God hates sin. You are going to see that. But for some reason, some people, they believe that you can sin as much as you like just because Jesus Christ died for our sins and because of grace, we can sin as much as we like. Some people believe that. So all you have to do is believe in Jesus Christ and you can sin as much as you like. Some people believe that. Why did Lucifer and one third of his angels get kicked out of heaven for? Because of sin. Now, they believed in God, right? But they sinned and got kicked out of heaven. Adam and Eve, they sinned and they got kicked out of the Garden of Eden. They believed in God as well. But for some reason, you believe that there is not going to be any punishment for people who choose to not obey the rules and regulations of the Bible. Something came to my mind last night or early this morning. Aleister Crowley, I believe his quote is, do as thou wilt, or something like that. Now, if you do research on that man, you are going to see what type of stuff that guy was into. Now, that guy is saying, do whatever you want. If you do research, and you may already know him, or no information about him. So he is saying, do whatever you want. And you are saying, do whatever you want as long as you believe in Jesus Christ. So how are you different from that guy? Do you believe, <laughs> do you believe that you are going to do whatever you like when you get to heaven or if you get to heaven? Do you believe that God is going to allow you to do whatever you want? Hey, if you want to fornicate with the angels, hey, go right ahead because do as thou wilt. Let's think of it in an earthly sense. What if in this world that we live in now, what if there were no laws? Think about the chaos. You are saying that you can sin as much as you like and you are going to get into heaven. So no rules. What if the city that you live in now had no rules that you can do as you please. Imagine the chaos. This is why I am thinking, do you know what you are saying to say that you can sin as you like and still get rewarded to get to heaven? That is evil. Think of it in a very natural sense someone getting rewarded for doing evil. So now evil is good and good is evil. That is backward. The thing about it, people know that that doctrine is so wrong, but 
you want to be so wicked that you are willing to believe whatever you want to. Even when you know it is wrong, it doesn't make sense. Everywhere you go, there have to be rules. There have to be rules. Because if everyone breaks the rules or don't have rules, there would be no order. And if you read the Bible, God is a God of order. He is not a God of chaos. That is Satan. Satan is a demon of chaos. Not God. So to keep on saying that you can do as you please, that makes no sense. Let me stop here.